Hi, um, my dear Libra, and welcome to your next 48. Thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate and value your time, okay? If you're interested in booking me um, for reading, you'll find my email listed in the description box below for you, Libra. Okay. Libra, what I'm getting is I feel like somebody's emotions and somebody's feelings for you grow each day, like... Each day, the emotions and feelings for you become stronger here. There is somebody that they feel so lost. They feel lost within themselves. And it, I feel like it's because of what this relationship is doing to them. Like internally, this person might, I feel like they've never felt like this before. And I feel like you are the resultant of that. You are the one that's impacting them this way, making them feel the way they do. Eight of Swords, this person, they, they're kind of stuck, okay? Stuck in the thought of you, constantly revisiting. It's like they in their feelings. And I feel like they feel like they can't get out of this state of being. They, they feel trapped in your energy. They feel like they can't stop thinking about you, nor can they let you go. And I, I don't think they want to. I don't think they want to let you go. I don't think they want to stop thinking about you. I feel like you make this person feel so bubbly or butterflies inside. You make them feel so warm inside. Whenever they think of you, they mood switches up, their mood changes, they feel more enthusiastic, more happy, more present. Even if you guys are on bad terms, just them knowing that, you know, you exist, it makes this person really happy, Libra. But they have things that they're working towards. Because I feel like somebody is guarded towards the other. I feel like you both are very guarded towards one another. There is definitely a strong sense of resistance on both your sides. You not wanting to give the whole way through, them not wanting to open up fully. There's just this, this resistance going on and it's, it's on both ends. It's reciprocated by the both of you here. Um, and I feel like it's causing this, this resistance that's happening. You guys holding back from one another a lot it, or this silence. Okay, it just causes this person a lot of frustration and makes them want to kind of go back to their old ways. Like, whenever they feel like they're at a loss when it comes to you, they always want to go back to their old ways because that's where they're most comfortable. You make them uncomfortable because you make them do things that they normally wouldn't do. You, you're making them become a different type of man, a different type of woman, and it's just, like, so different for this person. They don't know how to handle it. It's heavy on them, okay, Libra? It's heavy. And I feel like because of this heaviness, it's like they struggle on a day-to-day -day basis to kind of allow themselves to open up to anybody else. Like whenever they try to give their attention to anybody else, whenever they try to experience anyone else, it's kind of like they stop themselves and they find themselves kind of like saying, you know what, no, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. And they don't even know why. Well, they don't want to admit to themselves why. They don't want to admit that, you know, it's you, you are the pause, you are the stop whenever they try and do something else. I feel like you fulfill this person. Look, nine of cups, you fulfill this person. You make them feel whole. You make them feel relevant. You make them feel present. And when I say present, I feel like you make this, like this person spends a lot of time in their mind, in their head. And I feel like when they with you, they become more present. They become more, like they feel alive. They feel alive like they're experiencing life you know and i feel like you are the only one that can do this for them this person might love music okay there's this some there's a hobby that they love to do or something that they love that also keeps them afloat okay just like you do also like you make them feel whole there's something that they love this could even be a love for food a love for clothes there's something also that just that just makes them happy you know and I hear this person saying, if I could just have that and Libra, I'll be okay for the rest of my life. 
okay so definitely this person is reevaluating themselves and they their future goals and what they really want for themselves because i feel like you're changing how this person thinks you're changing how this person thinks libra you're changing their thought pattern this person could have had some unhealthy mindsets before but i feel like you've lifted that from them and now they're able to kind of do better And I feel like that's why they don't mind, you know, thinking about you all the time. They don't mind that experience because it just, it makes them better. It makes them feel good. It makes them feel happy. You make them happy. Okay. So why would they want to change that? Again. Look, nine of cups. So this person is like they fighting the fact that you could be the one for them or you fighting the fact that they could be the one for you or you both are fighting each other. But there is this resistance here. You both are kind of like fighting this. But at the back of their mind or the back of your mind, you know that this is for you also. You would really want to experience this. Because I feel like this, there's, this, there's something that's calling you towards this relationship and this person feels the same way too. There's something that kind of pulls you back to one another and you guys can't explain it, but it's there, it's present, it's real, it happens and it's happening. They feel it too, okay, Libra? They feel it too. They feel the pool. They feel the pool too. This person feels like you're the full package, okay, we have the Empress, okay, they feel like you're it. They feel like they don't, they don't need to long or yearn for anything else when they have you because there's no use for it. You have, you are all that they want, you have everything that they need, okay, which is beautiful. That's why the Nana Cups keeps showing up, it's like very fulfilling, like, it's very fulfilling, it's like you feel complete, they feel complete. Okay, it's like imagine feeling complete, like there's nothing else you might need. You're just good, you know, that type of feeling. That's beautiful, you know. And you bring that and evoke that within this person. Page of Pentacles, Seven of Swords. This person has some trauma here. They've been deceived deeply in the past. Like they've been lied to a lot. They've been deceived. And I feel like this deception lies upon the way they think now because they have this deep insecurity that keeps bugging them mentally even emotionally in some instances it just keeps them up at night they can't shake it off they can't shake the bad experiences of the past off off their shoulders they can't they, it's heavy on them and i feel like it impacts them greatly libra and you need to know this which tells me that, you know, you need to be patient with this person so you can understand them. And, you know, they're human too. They feel just like you and they, they, they're human also. I feel like you need to understand that. Don't be too hard on them. Um, it doesn't, it's just, it won't help. It makes things really worse. They've been through a lot, you know, just like you have. So you guys should really just meet each other halfway. Things will be better after that. Because you both are doing the work. No one is putting in less or more than the others. Like this equality, it's it's an equilibrium, okay, in sync, in tune, harmony, you know, two to two, your number, Libra, balance. Balance the scales. What's the Knight of Wands? This person is worried. It's like they might be worried that they're gonna mess this up. I feel like what's re what's maintaining an a what's maintaining as an anchor or pertaining as an anchor to this person is the fact that they feel like they're gonna mess this up. 
So it's easier for them to stay away. It's easier for them to resist you if they constantly put this in their thoughts that I might mess this up. To prevent that, they just avoid things altogether. It's like this fear controls them. And it could also be guilt, guilt of you know, past mistakes that they've done, they feel like they could repeat that, you know, they just don't want to do you wrong, Libra, like, it, it bothers them so much, they don't want to do you wrong, like, this connection, they value it more than you think, they value this more than you think, they, they feel this connection immensely and intensely in their day-to-day -day life, whether they show this or not, it's within it, they feel it, you know, Okay, Libra, that was your next video. Very interesting. Thank you so much for joining me. If you're interested in booking me for a reading, you'll find my email listed in the description box below. And I thank you for your time. I really value it, Libra. Okay. I'm sending you nothing but love, comfort, and healing. Until next time, my dear Libra. Bye.